Hello, today we are going to study about a chapter from Hornbill. The name of the chapter is The Browning Version, authored by Terence Rettigan. Now, let us first know about Terence Rettigan. The chapter is a one act play, a very short play with one or more scenes less number of characters but it is able to show what is there in the minds of the dramatist the author was a british dramatist born on 10th june 1911 in london he had a strong love for reading as well as writing plays he wrote his first play at the age of 10 and was the student of Trinity College, Oxford. His plays were very popular with critics and audiences in London. Even Browning version was first performed on 8th September 1948 at the Phoenix Theatre, London and it was a real hit. The play is about an unpopular but strong teacher. It is inspired by the author's own experience of school and its teacher. It is based on the relationships between the school teacher and the students and also between the teachers themselves. It touches the notions of fidelity, appreciation, honesty and truthfulness. Now before we start the chapter, let us peep into the characters in the play. Now see, characters are an important part. Let us first understand. Now in this play, there are only four characters. Mr. Andrew Crocker Harris, Mr. Frank Hunter. These both are the teachers. If we move further, we have John Taplow, who is the student studying in lower fifth and the last character is mrs millie crocker harris she is wife of crocker harris now let us understand the main protagonist of this chapter mr andrew crocker harris now andrew crocker harris is a middle-aged teacher in boys school boys public school He served in the same school from last 18 years. He is a very strict disciplinarian and so he is able to control his students in a very good manner. Now, why this person is so special? The speciality is that he never shrivels up in front of his students. That means he is very strict. He is very sincere and always works hard for the welfare of his students. He is stern and humorless. What do you mean by humorless? That means he is never able to create a good humor. He is never able to make good jokes. Whenever while teaching he makes jokes, nobody laughs as nobody understands. The play represents his penultimate day at the school. He is not liked by the students and the school does not seem to have much respect for him. His student Taplow's gift of the Agamemnon. Now this is a novel. We will come to know about it later in the story. Now, the student Taplow, he gifted this novel to his teacher and the inscription it contains awakens, it enlightens a latent sense, a hidden sense of emotions in him. Overall, he is definitely respected and liked by Taplow. Now, let us move on the next character and that is Frank Hunter. Frank Hunter is a dynamic young science teacher. He is well liked by his pupils, by his students at the school because he is very frank. He is too informal and quite friendly. 
he teaches a science but he dislikes the subject he is jealous of the fear of crocker harris that prevails in the mind of taplow he enjoyed taplow imitating his teacher crocker harris he encourages taplow to make fun of him somewhere somewhere i feel that frank hunter is not an appropriate teacher because this quality is not a good quality a teacher should have we cannot make fun of other teacher other colleagues in front of our students we should not now let us know something about john taplow now taplow is the first character to appear in the play he is one of the classic students of andrew crocker harris his actions create the emotional peak of the play he expresses to frank a respect and admiration for his teacher crocker harris actually actually mr harris was leaving the school to join a job somewhere else so taplow gifts andrew a book bought with his own money the agamemnon this reference is nowhere in the chapter this is somewhat found from internet taplow's actions are very sincere and genuinely heartfelt he is 16 years old he has arrived in the school to do extra work for mr harris now last but not the least millie crocker harris she is mrs harris wife of mr crocker harris she is young and quite different from her husband she varies she carries a you know a very sincere accent of wearing the outfit she is very smart okay now uh, let us continue with the understanding of the story now the scene is set in a school frank and crocker harris both are masters taplow arrives to do the extra work on the last day of for mr crocker harris as he missed a day the previous week he finds frank a science teacher in school frank asked him his name and the reason he is there taplow studies in the lower fifth standard and is about to get his result from his teacher mr harris mr crocker harris usually reveals the result on the last day of school and unlike other teachers he follows the rules and regulations strictly we can also say that mr crocker harris is the man of rules the other teachers they declare the result prior to the result declaration day but this person crocker harris is very sincere about the rules and regulations they both started with a conversation where frank asked him several questions we don't see mr harris in the whole chapter but we get to know a lot about him taplow wants to take science as a remove that means after he clears with this class in the next class definitely he is going to take science because according to him this subject is extremely interesting but frank on frank on the other hand doesn't like what he teaches in the school see what an irony he is and he, he is a science teacher but he does not like this subject to teach mr crocker harris is hardly human he told taplow that he will get what he deserves nothing less and certainly nothing more and this makes him more tense why because he feels that he will give marks only what a child deserves because he is not informal with the students 
Frank admits that he envies Mr. Crocker Harris because, because of the terrific effect the teacher has on his students. Taplow told him that he never shows his emotions like other teachers and never beats them up like other masters. According to Taplow, Crocker Harris is not the saddest. Now, while they were deeply engaged in the conversation, Millie Crocker Harris gives her entry. She enters and comes with a shopping bag in her hand. She asks Taplow to go out and come back when she actually learns. What is the problem with Taplow? She understands and so she tells Taplow to go out and come back in a quarter of an hour means within 15 minutes as Mr. Crocker Harris will be late. Now why Mr. Crocker Harris will be late? Because he is at the bursars. What is bursars? Bursars is the audit department so definitely he was busy there. Actually he called Frank at 6.30 in the evening. But presently he was 10 minutes late. Till 6.40 he has not arrived. And so Millie Crocker Harris, she informs him that it is possible he may be more late. Now, this student, Taplow, did not dare to leave the place without his teacher's permission. Here Crocker, Millie Crocker Harris was ready to take up the blame. So she told her, told him that if her husband arrives earlier, she will take up the blame. She further gives him a prescription, a medical prescription and gives him instructions to purchase medicines for her from the chemist. Taplow follows this and goes away to do the job. Now why this chapter is so special? Why this chapter is added in the curriculum of 11th class students? Because definitely we expect that the growing students should be inculcated with some very good messages, with some very good ethics and manners. Now through the Browning version summary, the writer wants to say that teachers are not as bad as they see. Definitely they are extremely strict but all they want is good for their students. A teacher is hard on students when it comes to studies but they are the true well-wishers of their students. Now this chapter definitely uh, is very precious for all of you but there are some tough meanings as well. Now, there are some uh, words which need to be understood. Like if I talk about remove, a division in a school, right? Like we have a slot of uh, primary school till class 5 and after that you come to the still higher level. Same way, the word remove shows a division in a school. Slackers. Now, uh, when Frank comes to know that Taplov is going to take signs. He speaks this word in front of him telling that we only get slackers. That means only the slackers join the science faculty. Means the lazy students. Uh, the boy Taplov, he was carrying a book with him. The Agamemnon. And for that he used the word muck. Muck means useless. Now there are uh, specific reasons in the chapter given. Now, uh, that was in a particular language and if the anything goes wrong while expressing or while uh, giving the answers or while writing, the teacher, uh, the teacher Crocker Harris punishes them by giving them 50 times to write again. There is one more word, captain means detained, cut means escape. Saddest, a person who gets pleasure out of giving pain to others. Shriveled up means a person having no feelings. I hope the chapter is very clear to you all. Thank you.